In this Skycat tutorial, you're going to learn how to use stack terminals, otherwise known as multi-level or multi-tier terminals. Here I have a list of terminals for a project, and they're all single-level terminals, not stacked. If you're not familiar with this view, we recommend watching the Managing Terminal Strips tutorial. From here we can select multiple terminals and convert them to stack terminals. For example, I'll select these two terminals and stack selected terminals. The two single level terminals have been merged into one stacked terminal. In parenthesis, we are shown that this is now a stacked terminal. Because this view is the single level view for terminals, we cannot see all the information pertaining to stacked terminals. We can see some information however, such as the manufacturer and part number. The information in the wire type, wire number, connected interior side, bridge, and connected exterior side cells refers only to the top level of stacked terminals. To see more information about your stacked terminals, select the terminal strip, go to the show tab, and select stacked terminal view. This view is not as compact as the single level view, but it shows all the details. It not only shows stacked terminals, but single level terminals, as well as terminal accessories such as end stops and separators. In this view, if we select this, we are selecting the terminal as a whole. If we select this, we are selecting the terminal junction. The same goes for stacked terminals. This is the terminal. This is the top level junction. And this is the bottom level junction. Stacked terminals can be unstacked by selecting the terminal, going to the Home tab, and selecting Unstacked Terminals. Terminals can also be stacked together from the schematics. Select the terminals you want to merge into a stacked terminal, and Stack Select Terminals. Notice the terminal strip layout changes accordingly. In case you've forgotten, this column indicates the terminal number, and these columns indicate the wire numbers. We can also stack terminals in groups instead of one by one. This can be done from the terminal list views. Let's say I want terminals 2 and 3 to become a stacked terminal, 4 and 5 to become a stacked terminal, and 6 and 7 to become a stacked terminal. Select all the terminals you want stacked, and select Group Stack Terminals. A message box appears where we can select how many levels we want the stack terminals to have, 2, 3, or 4. We're also given two different options for which order we want to stack them in. First, we could stack them sequentially. Or, we could stack them by splitting by levels. In this case, I want two level terminals and to stack them sequentially. So I'll click OK. The terminals are stacked just as we wanted, and the schematics are automatically updated.